Hey everyone, I am SimSweetie and welcome to part 15 of Let's Play The Sims 4 Get to Work. I think it's part 15. 14? I think it's 15. Okay, anyway, this is irrelevant, but in the last part, my microphone was super quiet because I did get a new microphone, so I apologize for that. I think I fixed it. And also, <clears throat> my voice is sounding like really strange today. I think it's from like allergies and stuff, but excuse that also. And you might be noticing we didn't pick off a pick what pick up exactly where we left off. I went ahead and played through most of Lucia's work day today because I didn't want it to be you know super repetitive. She basically just took care of patients, and her work day will be ending in about an hour and a half. But she needs to perform a treadmill test on a patient, and I think we're going to go ahead and do that. Well, oh look at who's back. Vicente is back. Let's see what the Vicente. We will refer for a treadmill test, mm, but yes, I don't know what sound that was, I'm like, mmm, terrifying. And then after that, I'm trying to decide, I want to have them go out and take maternity pictures because I posted, I posted? No. I placed a photography studio from the gallery into the town. So I want to go there and take like maternity pictures of Zoe because I think that would be like adorable and we can give her like a cute little outfit. But I can't decide if we should do it when Lucia gets home from work today or if we should just wait till tomorrow and Lucia can take a day off of work because I kind of really want her to be there, you know? I don't know because I believe she should have some vacation days to use. So I will have to decide that soon. And I was reading your comments and some of you guys were saying you want to have a day where Lucia and Zoe get to hang out together. I think that would be really fun. And so they can get to know each other. But it says the results of the treadmill test on Vicente are inconclusive. Wonderful. Anyway, we're going to be heading home in just a second. We already made it to the gold, so we're going to pretty much just hang out for a little while. Zoe, oh I can't actually see her moodlets, but she is in her second trimester of her pregnancy right now. Oh yes, we were promo- oh, look at this little hat! Look at- look at the little hat! It's kind of like an oversized fe an oversized fez. That's what I meant. <laughs> okay, Lucia has now been promoted to assistant nurse. She will now make an additional 19 simoleons per hour for a grand total of 68 simoleons per hour. She has also received the following bonus. 384 simoleons, a restless thank- rest- what is this? A restless thankless medical stool. Okay. Um, surgery tables at work can now be used to treat the most severe patient conditions. <gasps> We can perform a surgery. Okay. And you can now check hotness. So we can check hotness. Probably like in a medical term, but she can walk up to a real nice man and be like, you're nice and hot. I actually like put my hand on my computer screen for dramatic effect and then I realize you can't see me. Um, her next shift is at Tuesday at 6 a.m. Oh my gosh, she works so early now. 6 a.m. She must get out of work pretty early, I'm assuming. Because... Before she was working, she started her workday at 9, and now it's 6. Ugh, terrible hours. But I'm so proud of our Lucia. She's moving up in the career tracks. What, I think she's on level, like, 5 now? 5, maybe. But I gotta know, so she doesn't work on Mondays, Thursdays, and Sundays. No, Saturdays. Just kidding, Saturdays. Um, and she works from 6 o'clock a.m. to 4 o'clock p.m. That's like some pretty long hours because she was working from 9 to 5, so... Uh, oh, we need to pay bills. Uh, hmm. I was so excited because I really, really, really want to get Antonio a baking book, but I think they're super, super expensive, so I've got to see how much they are. But I'm going to transfer all of our money into one area real quick okay that's all of our money that's all we got so i want him to our bills are 683 simoleons that's really not cheap for what our funds are anyway i need you to what am i doing buy a book can i you buy books yes you buy books through the computer okay oh there i don't know what i was expecting um we're gonna go under skills maybe okay it's right here and 2500 simoleons. I mean, maybe we could spend like all of our money on it. <clears throat> My voice is like disappearing. Real fun. <clears throat> voice, do not do this on me. 
Um, we could sell our frogs. I want to get that book. But we're not going to have money for bills. Like, this is a sticky situation. I don't want to sell our camera. We are literally so close to being able to afford that book. I mean, we won't be able to afford our bills, but... What are you going to do about that, you know? I want to find something to collect. Oh, cool, there's stuff back here. Hey, you can- well, I'm not gonna make the pregnant woman do it. We'll make Antonio dig. I think we will- I don't know. Maybe- I'm trying to decide what I want to do. I think they'll go out for pictures tomorrow and we'll let Lucia go to work on her own. Yeah, we'll do that. That will work out all good. Even though I really wanted Lucia to be able to come, but I guess, you know, she's not really going to be able to. Um, okay. Should we open this? You know, we're just gonna sell it because I always seem to lose money on it anyway. Let's extract our fossil. A uh, one enormous, enormous trilobite. What is that? I gotta see. I gotta see what this is. What a trilobite is. There's just like bowls shown on the ground. Oh, it looks like some kind of like rib cage. Who knows? It's worth 40 simoleons. Oh my gosh, we're so close. Yes, we have enough money. Girl, get off the computer! I know, that'd be me, just like, on the computer. That literally is me, though. All times of the day, on the computer. Go order books. And we're gonna do it, we're gonna buy... Oh, but what if this is... What if he's too skilled for this and we buy it and then it's like... He'd probably need number two, wouldn't he? Oh, number... Th they're the same price. Intelligent, right? I think we're gonna buy number two. Yeah, the <laughs> baking number three is by the Swedish, Swedish chef, if I could speak. Um, I'll read you this little excerpt, whatever, here. It's not called an excerpt, it's a synopsis, that's what it's called. Nailing down the ideal shape for a baked good can be a tricky endeavor. Should the cookie be a circle, triangle, tetrahedron? I think I said that right. Frank Oz explains the optimal shape for a variety of baked goods using a formula he created himself. Read on to discover the mathematical formula that's rocking the world of, or yeah, the world of modern baking. There goes all of our simoleons. <laughs> ah, wonderful. Anyway, I gotta see Lucia's little hat here. I mean, look at this. Look at this little hat. Look at that little hat, everyone. Look at it. It's wonderful. It's a wonderful little hat. Oh, but I gotta see where she is. Like, what level is she at? She's actually a level five. Oh, that's right. Okay. Um, what do I want Zoe to do? Zoe, why don't you work on your garden out here? We will water everything and then we'll weed it if necessary. I think we're just gonna have the night in and then we'll go out tomorrow. Like I said, I need... Um, Lucia to read her book and we'll have Antonio read his book. Are you gonna read it? Read it. Read it and weep. No, not really. Don't weep. I don't think that'd be good. Um, I'll look at them. A sibling time reading. Why is she are, are you talking to your book? You okay? You okay? Lucia? Yeah? You good? Uh, I don't know. What is Zoe doing? She's gonna eat an onion bagel. Is she hungry? Yes, yeah, she is. Are her plants okay though? Yeah, they're okay. Let's have her, oh, we have spoiled food in here. Let's toss that. Why do you have an onion bagel in your inventory? Who knows? Anyway, she will eat that and then she'll go to the bathroom. What does she want to do, Cloud Gaze? Be friendly with Antonio. He wants to be friendly with Zoe. He wants to become friends with Fletcher, who is a teen, so that's a little bit creepy. And she wants to take a vacation day. Oh, should we just have her take a vacation? We can't have her take a vacation day tomorrow. We got bills to pay. I'm sorry, Lucia, but tomorrow is just, it's not a good time. Are you painting this? No, it's Antonia who's painting this. Oh, you wanna hug her? Look at how pregnant she is. Oh my goodness. I, I cannot. I cannot even. Read your book. That book was expensive. Did she finish reading that book? Because she needs to for her. Oh good, she did. Awesome. We'll put that back. Well, we'll put it in our inventory, I guess. And then we'll have her read one more book. We'll have her read Reel Her In. She reads Lucia, is who she I am referring to, reads a lot of like romance books. I'm not really sure why. Maybe Lucia wants some romance in her life. Who's walking around out here? 
Who dis? Is this a teen? No, she's an adult. Her name is Asia. Okay. That's a pretty cool name. Yeah, I saw some comments saying we should just wait on Lucia's love life. You know, she... She doesn't really... She wants to focus on her career right now. She's not really, like, in love with anyone right now or has a quote-unquote quote-unquote crush on anyone right now. So I think we're gonna wait a little while, but I mean, it is hard seeing, you know, this happening over here and her brother being like, totally found the love of his life and is pregnant and starting their family. And Lucia's over here like, um, okay, you do that then. So I hope that Lucia doesn't really feel pressured to get in a relationship, you know. Who knows what happens and i also hope that antonio and zoe's relationship works out because i'm not totally sure what's gonna happen because okay what are you i, I need to throw this away woman no 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 we're throwing that away we can make money off of it okay cool oh our bills are expensive you should be reading your book at every second of the day like not even kidding you need to read where did you put the book where did you put that book that book does not go in the bookcase. Could you imagine buying a book for $2,500? I mean, for real so. Okay, he's almost improved his skill. I'm glad this book is working out. Yeah, someone commented saying they're like so sick of the donuts and I'm like, I know, right? So we're gonna work on getting his like skill up and then we'll go back to the bakery. Um, but since everyone is just gonna kind of hang out for the rest of the evening, oh, look at them. He actually reached level five with the baking skill. Antonio can now bake carrot bread. Carrot bread. Interesting. Lemon bars, carrot cake. I'm familiar with that. Spinach and mushroom quiche. I love quiche. I love spinach. And I love mushrooms. That literally sounds like the best thing ever. I actually, I had spinach quiche like last week and it was so good. Anyway distracted potato bread also interesting spinach and onion quiche in a kitchen okay he can now bake cream filled donuts oh guys look more donuts aren't you thrilled um plain scones a jelly filled donuts at the cupcake factory there was no and that was kind of a dysfunctional sentence anyway everyone's pretty much gonna go to bed and i uh, will see you guys in the morning good morning everyone lucia is heading off to work alone i really wanted her to come take pictures with us but because you know we need the simoleons right now she is going to have to go alone but i think i trust her so goodbye lucia see you later and Zoe is currently sleeping. Antonio is getting up. Oh, and Zoe is in her third trimester, so she can really be having that baby like any minute now. But we need to get over there and take our pictures ASAP. I think we'll actually get her up now, even though she's still a little bit tired. I just wanted to be able to get out and take those pictures because, like, she's literally so pregnant. Like, so, so, so pregnant. It's insane. Um. Dude, get out of the shower. Your wife needs the shower. Um, I think what we'll do right now is change her appearance, 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 and get her a cute little outfit. Alrighty, I am back with Zoe Patel, and I gave her two outfits to take some photos in. The first one is a little bit more modest, but you can definitely still see the bump, which is massive, and it's in a nice dainty formal pretty kind of outfit and then the second one is just in her undies because like that belly though that belly though and it's a very it's a more natural look so that is what we got going on we're gonna go down to the photography studio and i will show you guys where i downloaded it from actually i <clears throat> my voice i just ate some dark chocolate Oh my gosh it's so good i love i love chocolate so much dark chocolate is definitely my favorite i used to hate dark chocolate but guys it is so good <sighs> anyway she should eat something really quickly and then we will go ahead and get on out of here actually just kidding antonio has to eat something too and then we will get on out of here and like I said, I'm not going to open up the bakery again until we can really get Antonio to a really good baking skill. You know, reading- I told you to eat food, darling. Eat food. Um, I got distracted. Oh, and Antonio painted this last night. That's really cool. We will have to sell that. We'll put it in his inventory for now. But I want to wait until he can really get his baking skill up so we can, you know, make the best of the situation. 
She will have her work hard later. I don't want Lucia to get super stressed out by work. And I'm hiccuping because I like just ate and you know, food is digesting. That's- why are you cooking? I told you to eat something! For goodness sake, eat something, my dear. Have a quick meal, eat some cereal. Ooh. Oh, look at them holding hands. Cuties! Oh god! Um, grab your cereal, eat it, because I really want to get some pictures before your wife pops. In the meantime, I will show you the gallery they're going to go to. It is called the Flint Photography Studio by Slam Cat. And it's really, it's like a, what did they say? Did they say? Oh, I thought they, that's something. Uh, anyway, it's kind of like a tropically almost looking theme and it's really cool and I think it's awesome. So, anyway, I don't know why I'm whispering. A little bit of like ASMR. Just kidding. Does anyone else watch ASMR videos or is that just me? Cause like, I really like ASMR. Just saying. Anyway, uh, let's get out of here guys because I don't want your wife to give birth before we take her maternity photos. Let's travel with, and we're gonna travel with Zoe Patel. I think I'm starting to like get used to Zoe and Lucia's names because you know, in the first parts of her moving in, I was like calling Zoe Lucia. Yep, yeah, that's right. Like the whole time. So I think I'm starting to get it now. Anyway, here it is right here. I put it down on that lot because I didn't really know where to put it, but there looked good as any. <clears throat> I mean, it's by some residential lots, but what can you do? Um, we're gonna travel over there, we'll take a couple pictures, it'll be a real good time. And I think it should work. I kinda tested it out like really, really quickly and I'm pretty sure it should, but I'm not totally sure. And oh, look at this, here we are. So what I really liked about this place was A, the theme. I thought it just looked really cute in Oasis, Oasis Springs, is that where we are? Probably. And you could actually take pictures outside or inside, which was also awesome here. It is with the walls up. Are the walls up? Yes. No, the walls are not. There we go. The walls are up. That's what it looks like. And I just thought it was, it looked awesome. Anyway, what do I want to do? Yeah, like I said, you can take pictures inside, but the lighting is like, I don't know. It makes it look a little yellow. So we can set a backdrop. What if we set it just white? Okay, this is the white. What if we... I don't know if I want to take it outside or inside. Oh, I think scaling got messed up and that's why this is here. It's like actually supposed to be bigger. Okay, I got it. Um, What do I want to do here? So, what if we take a photo of... We're going to take a photo of Zoe. Oh, actually, Zoe has to get in the right outfit first. Oh, her, she must be having some serious back pain. She is so pregnant. Oh my goodness. We're gonna start with her party wear too. What are you doing? Hold on. Hold on. Change. Girl, change. Oh, poor Zoe. And then we will have Antonio get over here and take a photo of Zoe Patel. Who else is working here? We have our employee named Julian Stanton. Hello, Julian. And Eva Slade. Hello, Eva. Anyway, let's take these pictures. And I believe the pose is just like randomized. That is quite the pose there. And we have some options. We can take a small photo, a medium photo, or a large photo. And of course, we uh, the large photo is the only like other option. Yep, that's a word. Option that we don't have on our camera because we don't have the fanciest camera ever. I kind of want to like undersaturate. I think that looks really nice. The vignette looks kind of weird, but <laughs> I mean, this is quite the pose here. I'm not even going to lie, but I dig it. It works. So let's take that picture. We'll take like three. And that's with the small, so maybe we'll take another two in medium. There we go. So those were a couple pictures. And then let's take, can, I don't think she can pick her pose. I'm fairly certain she cannot. No, I don't think so. Anyway, let's have him take another photo of Zoe Patel. I think they're all, I like this picture. This picture's gonna be a cute one. What if we get her face? Well, I wanna get her belly in there too. Um, right about there should be good. And we will take a picture. Okay, wait, oh, wait, wait, right there, okay. Take another picture. Oh, maybe we should put a filter on it. Oh, I wanna do the undersaturate, huh? Have you a vignette? Undersaturate. I'll do undersaturate. <laughs> and, um, take a medium photo like that too and that should be good okay one more time 
let's have her change in or maybe we'll do it two more times let's change it to her party wear three which is the just the undies really stripping down here but you know she's rocking it she is rocking it and we will take a photo of zoe patel are you annoyed to me saying zoe patel oh my gosh she's like totally rocking it girl get it zoe get it get it zoe alrighty we need to figure out that looks like a good good picture to take oh we can actually switch the orientation we could take a cool picture like that awesome medium photo like oh wait i should undersaturate hold on i think that looks really nice and under saturation i also want to take i think a black and white like this i am digging these pictures okay um small photo too let's take a small photo in the other well i don't know maybe we'll do like wait not white vignette there we go um and then i want to rotate it again and we'll take a small photo like this and oh that's all okay and we'll do one more this is really fun i have not done very much photography stuff yet so i am having a lot of fun can i move the camera no why can't i move the camera oh there we go um that one really doesn't show off her belly we're gonna try again get a different pose let's see here take photo of there we go um and that's not a very good one either try it again <laughs> we're gonna keep doing this guys until we get the right pose Ooh, that's sassy that's kind of similar to the other one you know i'm being way too picky over here let's try it again try it again and what are we gonna get oh oh i like oh my gosh oh my goodness this pose why can't i move the camera okay here we are you can't really see her belly, but I mean, girl, a <sighs> girl, what? She's, she's rocking it. She's rocking it. Gotta do a nice black. This looks so artistic, honestly, right now. I am like, <sighs> so artistic. I love it. I love it. We gotta get it over here and take some pictures of um, Lucia sometimes. That'd be really fun. And I didn't really like look at any of these other options. Hmm. Anyway, undersaturate's good to me. Take one like this, rotate it. Um, we'll take one like this, and let's do a little bit bigger. And we will take one like this, and in grayscale too. Okay, there we go. <clears throat> I think that should be enough pictures. I wish we could take, can we take a picture with, he can't take a picture of himself. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Can we ask someone to, like, take a picture of us for us? I don't think we can, actually. Um, okay, that actually worked out quite well. I think we will go ahead and, um, we could travel home or maybe we could go out for the day. I don't know, that could be kind of fun. Or we could work at the bakery, but I don't really want to work at the bakery since, um, you know, he needs to work on his baking skill um let's just go home we will have them travel with i should probably actually be wrapping up this part huh yeah i'm gonna go ahead and wrap this part up right here i know i could probably wait until she has the baby but i'm gonna put you in suspense and you guys will find out next part but i'm gonna pre-film it right now so i'm not gonna have to wait um yes anyway i will talk to you all later make sure to subscribe and yeah bye